Hi, my name is Paul DiCarlo, and I'm going to introduce you to the Microsoft DreamSpark program, which has been extended to the students at the University of Houston. Uh, some brief background, this program was started by Bill Gates and has provided over 35 million students with software development and design tools over the years. Um, it was created with the intent to give students the ability to have hands-on development with Microsoft design and development tools that they can't otherwise afford. Now, it's very easy to use this software. The only thing that it requires is a Hotmail account or um, .NET Passport account. So when you visit the DreamSpark.com website, all you have to do is sign in with that account. And now that I've logged in, I simply need to verify myself as being a student at the University of Houston. This is a very quick process and you only have to do it one time. Simply click to verify as a student and at U of H just choose the get verified through my school button here and click continue. A school filter will show up. Of course we want to choose Texas for UH. Go Cougs. And when this list gets populated we'll choose the University of Houston as our school. And then continue. Now all we have to do here is fill in our information and this will send a verification to our email address. Now the email that you provide here does have to be the .edu address associated with the University of Houston. So when I put my email here, it's going to send a verification email to my address. I'm not going to show that portion here, but you simply check the email and it's going to give you an instruction code. And then you can log in and use the website to download um, the various products that are featured on the front page. Some of these are really exciting. We have Visual Studio 2010 Professional, uh, brand new phone development tools, Server 2008 R2. This is excellent stuff if you just want to get your hands wet on some software that's otherwise unavailable. I'll go ahead and show real quick uh, how this works with an account that's already been set up sign out and sign in with my original account and you'll see I've been verified so the check mark appears here on the it's easy portion and I can choose any software that I want let's say I want to try uh, Visual Studio well, why would I want 2008? Let's try uh, Visual Studio uh, 2010 Professional. Very simple. Um, simply click the sign in ver uh, button has already been checked. Verify button has already been checked and I simply go to download. There's no product key required here so it's not going to ask me for that. Now different software that appears here may need uh, require the generation of a key. Um, in that event it's uh, very simple. Same, same process. Uh, click the get key button and after doing this once that key will remain there forever and you can download the software now and when Microsoft asks you to um, give you the genuine key you simply enter in that key that's been generated there so all the software here um, you can use this is great stuff uh, there's even game development stuff for XNA video uh, game developers the virtual PC uh, which uh, allows for virtualization of Windows um, Multipoint mouse SDK. This is excellent stuff that you otherwise wouldn't be able to get your hands on. Uh, embedded CE, SQL Server, etc. So plenty of good stuff on here that can keep you busy for a really long time, especially if you're into Microsoft software. Um, I know all of us uh, who are in technology and computer science can benefit from the Visual Studio 2010 Professional, um, etc. So. Why not go ahead and get started with this? Um, I also suggest the phone development tools as Microsoft is currently uh, waiving the $99 marketplace fee. So if you can make something, um, a flashlight application, a fart app, whatever, there, it's, the, it's a pioneer ground. People are racing to develop apps for this right now. So go ahead and uh, get started with that as well. And uh, I hope that you find this uh, tool very useful in your endeavors. And uh, I'd like to thank Microsoft for extending this, this to the university. And it's been my pleasure sharing this product with you.